She's just going to need a bit of room. They come up the rise and Sweet Deal moves up to Lover Lover. And Smooth landing up the fence. Elise gets the run as well. The two favourites, Elise, went straight past Champagne Cuddles. Then Cellar Girl and one more, honey. Hasn't she got a motor, Elise? That was electrifying. Elise's in the uh, Group 1000 Guineas this weekend and gets to be the beneficiary of the first flight stakes winner that is allowed two weeks into the thousand guineas, which is, um, you know, which is perfect for her. It allows us uh, plenty of time and there's no rush for her to be ready for this race. And also gave us the opportunity to ensure that she pulled up 100% from the flight stakes in order to press on with her campaign, where she'll now be sixth up for this group one. That aside, she just seems to have done really well and we're all really happy with the way she's come through her Sydney Grand Final. I think if she can just stay at that level, then she's going to be uh, extremely competitive on the weekend. Elise, uh, what an exciting filly and what a dash of speed today. She's always had a huge rap onto this filly. She's been work in progress and she's delivering the goods at the moment. She just glided around the Caulfield um, course proper on Tuesday morning. Got, got the opportunity to not only uh, get on her Melbourne leg, but have a good look at the circuit there and uh, just came off the gallops licking her chops and um, uh, you know, in, in a really good frame of mind. Her preparation's been perfect for this and uh, you know, from that perspective, um, you know, we're, we're, uh, we're anticipating a, a really strong performance again.